guys so I'm gonna start a new vlog here um, I have not vlogged in a really long time mostly because I was busy I had bad lighting there we go I had college orientation and then I got my wisdom teeth out um, so yeah but today is going to be fun and tomorrow's gonna be fun and Saturday's gonna be fun so I figured I would take you guys along with me my hair is not cooperating right now so I have cornrows again I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see them um yeah so I did my makeup I am wearing naked on the run palette I have NYX butter gloss and it's actually in my pocket let me switch hands here vanilla cream pie and so I curled my hair um, just because I haven't washed it in a while and I just wanted to do something so it looked good with the corners. Um, I'll flip the camera around to show you my outfit. I'm going to the harbor again tonight, which is the free concert. And so this yeah. is the outfit that I am wearing. It is jean shorts from, I think, Old Navy. Yep, from Old Navy. And this top from Target. It's like loose and flowy and I really like that the bottom has like this cutout and the cutout in front. It's a little low cut, but we're also going to the beach tomorrow, so I have my beach bag packed. I have my sleepover bag packed. And then I want to show you, we went shopping today, and we got some undies at Victoria's Secret. So this first one is just a periwinkle boy short lace kind. And then the second one is a thong that's like gray, and it has these peach flowers with a little dog on it. The flower ones are my favorite. <laughs> and then I have this like neon watermelon color one and a neon pink one with the flower lace um, another neon pink one but this one has like a different type of lace and stripes and that same one in like again this neon watermelon color I got one of the yoga ones just because I wanted to see what they were like so it is like pink and purple it says pink on the side and then I got this one which is like tie-dye pink lace and I got this one also in tie-dye blue lace and I got one of these flower ones um, with like a teal color but I already wore those ones so Water. We're not supposed to be in the water, but we're in the water, and it's fun, and I hope I don't drop my phone. Squishy? Mm. It's not like actually a beach. We don't live anywhere near an ocean. It's a lake. Look at the pretty view. And then behind me, this way, it's just like trees and shit. Yeah. Like, I was like literally just saying before they said that, like they probably don't fucking care. Yeah, now they do. So Haley made this like little fort hut thing for a potato bug. It's beautiful. It's my best creation I think I've ever created. <laughs> Bidding starts at one million dollars. <laughs> what are you having? Barbecue chicken. That's my choice. <laughs> 
Hi guys! So, I just got ready. Um, I did my hair, I curled it, and I did my makeup. I used Naked on the Run again. Um, my bed is a mess because I literally have all these clothes plus my blankets. It's a mess. Anyways, um, I used Naked on the Run again. Um, contour, blush, highlight. Yeah, it's a little heavy today because we're having like family portraits done and the woman said to do your makeup a little heavier so it shows up on camera. I used the um, Makeup Forever HD foundation so hopefully that will help. I haven't changed yet. I'm wearing a Disney shirt from 2009 um, but I have to put my clothes on so maybe I'll show you my outfit when I get it on. Hey guys, so I just got out of work and I'm with Haley. We're going to pick up Cassidy because we're the sun is like totally making me look like shit. Anyways, um, we're going to pick up Cassidy because we have a grad party that we're going to and maybe I'll vlog a little bit there. Like I don't want to make it obvious because it's kind of weird, but I'll talk to you guys later and update you when there's something to update you about. So it's been a while since I filmed a clip for this vlog. I was thinking about ending it after today, um, but I just wanted to add some clips because I found out that Buxom has eyeshadows and I didn't know they did. Um, and when I went in store to like swatch them, they turned out, they, they feel so nice. Like they literally feel so nice. So creamy and nice and everything like that. So I went ahead and purchased um, a palette. And I was going to use it to do my makeup today for work. So I was going to show you the colors I got. And then I was going to show you the finished look. So I'm going to go ahead and put my camera right here. So it's the Empty Customizable customizable Eyeshadow Palette. Um, I, You can fit six eyeshadows in here. I only fit four in right now um, because... The other two I wanted, they didn't have in stock. So I'm actually going before work today to go see if they have them in stock. So it looks like this. And the eyeshadows are huge. Um, I don't want to blind you. The eyeshadows are really big. Um, and I, when I saw this, I decided I was going to get eyeshadows that, one, I don't have. Two, are interesting and are unlike anything I have. And three, uh, draw my attention. I'm not going to go for straight neutrals. So... Um, the other two that I wanted, one was like a duochrome, um, white, pink, purpley color. If you, uh, have seen Hippo by Colourpop, it's like that, except not for your cheeks, it's for your eyes. And the other one was a, like, a silvery purple with a lot of glitter in it, and I wanted that one that I didn't have in. So, the ones that I got here, oh, this palette was $40, by the way, and it includes this empty, like, palette container and then a six eyeshadows, which I don't think is a bad um, bad price at all, especially for the size of the eyeshadows. So this first one here is called Room Service, and I haven't touched these yet. I only swatched them in store. Um, and this is one of those shadows that's like a duochrome, um, white, green, super shimmery, beautiful shade. You can see it looks a little white, a little yellow, a little gold, a little green, no matter, you know, wherever the light touches it. So I really love that shade. The second one I got is called Mink Magnet, and this is on the neutral side, but oh my gosh, it's so gorgeous. It's like a bronze pink shade. It's super shimmery. I love that shade. The other one I got is called Pure Platinum, which this is the most pigmented silver shade I've ever seen in my life, so I had to pick that up. Um, I know there's a silver in my Lorac Pro 2 palette, but... It's not like that. It's not as pigmented and creamy as this one. And then the last one I have here is called Nofo. And it is blue-brown basically for MAC, which I don't own. It's this last one. So it looks blue-green in the pan. But um, swatched, it has a brown undertone and a duochrome that makes it look almost purpley, blue, rusty, no matter, you know, wherever the light touches it. So those are the ones I got. I can, I will show you the other two if um, I'm able to pick them up today. If not, then I'll show them to you 
some other time. But yeah, I wanted to let you guys in on this little secret because honestly, I didn't know Buxom had eyeshadows and I didn't know they were this nice. So definitely when you're in Sephora next time, check this out. So I'm going to go do my makeup with this and I will show you the finished look when I come right. back. So I finished the look using the new palette. Um, I'm going to let you look. So I used three of the four colors. This is hard for me to show you. Three of the four colors that I have here. So I used this blue-brown like MAC shade um, all over the lid. And then I used this last shade over here, the like green looking one, um, as my highlight, my brow bone highlight. And I used the silver as my inner corner highlight with just a little bit of that room service color um, on top of it because I thought the pure platinum while it's so pigmented and really nice looking, it was a little too dark, I think, for the inner corner. So, yeah. And then I have been obsessed with um, Vanilla Cream Pie, I think it's called, from NYX on my lips. Like, I just think it's the most gorgeous Barbie pink color. Let me just make sure that that's the name of it. Yep, vanilla cream pie. I just love it. It's such a like really bright baby pink color without being unflattering. So yes, I'm going to end the vlog here unless I find those other two shadows and then I'll show you them. If not, I hope you guys like this vlog. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe and I will talk to you guys later probably in another vlog. Bye!